So when you're ready, just finding a comfortable position. You don't have to sit completely upright if you're sitting, but just make sure that your spine feels supported and slightly elongated. You can do that whether you're sitting or laying so that we have a free flow of energy through our energetic body. If that means you'd like to sit with a backrest or prop yourself up against a wall to make that a little more comfortable, that is a beautiful option. And then if you haven't already, just closing down your eyes and begin to settle your energy. See if you can feel all parts of yourself arriving. Sometimes we show up like scattered stardust and other times we're already in the density of our bones. I want you to see if you can feel into the heaviness of your physical body, the density of your bones, the structure of your muscles, feeling every part of yourself arriving here as though you're calling all parts of yourself home. Our minds can get very messy and kind of almost blow like the wind and scatter our little stardust thoughts everywhere. And so we end up with parts of ourselves in many different places. And so this meditation will invite you into ground back into the here and now and to find yourself, all parts of yourself, back into your physical body. See if you can now drop your attention down to your sit bones, your butt, your pelvic region, and feel whatever part it is of your anatomy in that region that's in contact with earth or whatever surface is beneath you. Because beneath whatever surface you're sitting on, if you drill down and down and down and deeper, you get to Mother Earth. And so feel this sense of heaviness as though you're planting yourself into your seat. And then feel that heaviness start to move down through the legs all the way down to your feet and it's not a sticky heaviness it's a heavy but light sensation as though you're heavy and connected but there's flow and movement of energy from the lower part of your body down towards your feet And so you're holding within your awareness simultaneously stillness and internal movement of energy. Now take your awareness to your breath and just notice if the breath is in the chest, in the belly, just kind of check in with where it's located and see if you can send it down. You might be able to physically breathe into the lower part of your abdomen. And if there's any restriction there, you can just use the imagination. It's a wonderful thing. Let's see if you can take a few deep breaths into the depths of your belly, filling up on the inhale. And as you exhale, send the energy down as though you're breathing out of your feet. We'll do this a few more times. So a big, deep breath into the very pit of your belly. Fill up all the way. And then as you exhale, the energy is being sent out as though you're breathing out of your feet. We'll do that three more times.
last one, filling up all the way, deep breath, and exhaling all the way out, the energy, the breath, the prana moves from the belly, down the legs, past the knees, the shins, and out of your feet. Now you can allow the breath to keep doing what it's doing or, or move into a more spontaneous rhythm. I want you to bring your awareness now back into that lower part of your body. And working with this sense of energy moving from the base, down the legs and out the feet. Can you start to imagine as though from the base of your pelvis, you're growing roots as though you are a beautiful willow tree. And from the base, those roots expand and they move effortlessly through the legs, through the feet. And they do what roots do. They move deeper. They connect to a water source deep in the earth. And so as you feel your internal root system moving from the pelvis all the way down, there's a sensation of plugging in to Mother Earth. That feeling of the roots as they twist and turn and make their way effortlessly through any rock or any particle in their way to connect with where they need to be. And you might have multiple root systems. It might be hundreds, thousands, or whatever it is for you. However the base of your tree looks. Drilling you down, connecting into earth. And now that you've established this connection, now that you feel that your roots are firmly planted in the earth beneath you, now begin to feel as though you're drawing energy up. You're drinking. If you were a tree, you'd be drinking water. In this instance, maybe you're drinking some amrit, some life nectar. And again, we simultaneously hold the sensation, the energy experience of feeling grounded and movement at the same time. So as you feel your tree roots firmly planted in the earth, they begin to draw nectar up, water, liquid, substance. You can envision it as, you, as your beautiful imagination takes you and feel it as it starts to fill up and nourish and it moves from the tree trunks from the depths of your root all the way up your feet your legs and it pools in the pit of your belly and see if you can be with that for a few moments so you're drawing this energy up feeling it move along the legs and pooling in the base of the belly and you're not greedily suck, suck, sucking <laughs> and taking. There's an energy exchange that's happening here as you just take what you need from the earth and let it pool in the pit of your belly. And then just allowing the drawing up to cease. Keep the rootedness, keep the heaviness in the lower part of your body and bring your attention to the base of the belly. And that beautiful nectar, that life-giving substance that you have gathered from Mother Earth in this symbiotic exchange. 
as you inhale, can you now imagine that and feel it moving from the base of the spine all the way up the back of the spine, out through the crown. And as you exhale, it's as though it's washing over the front of your body, creating a circular ecosystem. We do that again as we inhale, it moves from the base all the way up each vertebrae of your spine, up and over through the crown, and then out of the nose, like a waterfall, pouring back down, pooling once again in the belly. We'll be with this sensation for a few more moments, breathing in, feeling that nectar move up the spine, igniting each of your energy centers along the way, and exhaling it out. feeling as though you've now been bathed in this nectar, as though your energy system has been aligned and enlivened with this amrit, this nectar. I'm allowing that visualization to cease now. And I invite you just to gently rest your hands across the pit of your belly in any formation that you like, whatever feels comfortable. Or if you prefer to place them on your thighs facing down, you can. And we just marinate in the, towards the end of this experience, just with a few breaths down into the very base. Feeling held, supported, nourished, and held by Mother Earth the connection of your energetic body with the energetic body of the earth, moving, breathing as one beautiful being in this gorgeous dance of symbiosis, the giving and the receiving. Feel the ground beneath you once again and say to yourself just inside of your mind, I am grounded I am here, I am present, I am earth. And then gently starting to bring a little bit of awareness back into your physical body. So a little twinkle of your fingers and your toes letting your root systems fall away. And when you're ready, just take a big, full breath in together and then open the mouth, a deep exhale, let it out. And when you feel ready, you can start to blink your eyes open and come on back. Thank you for meditating with me today. If anyone has any questions um, or anything you'd like to share, you're welcome to do so. Otherwise, we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, Teagues. Thanks, Anne. Thanks, Anne. Thank you. How do you feel now, darling? Yeah, a bit of that headache's actually lifted. Mm. Mm. Amazing. Love that bit of healing nectar it'll do wonders for you yeah thank you you're welcome my love enjoy the rest of your day yeah you too i'll see you soon okay bye